Hello there everybody and welcome back to another Terraria modding tutorial. In this episode we are going to be creating a basic, basic, basic biome uh, so we can spawn certain ores or monsters and whatnot. So first thing we're going to do is public static int biome tiles equals zero. And then we're going to do another int. This is going to be granite index equals tasks dot find index gen pass gen pass dot name dot equals granite. If granite index is not equal to minus one, tasks dot insert granite index plus one, new pass legacy tutorial basic biome delegate. Generation progress 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 dot message equals generating custom biome and then what we're gonna do is just do a or int i equals zero i is less than four i plus plus I do world gen dot tile runner world gen dot gen van dot next zero to main dot max tiles x well gen dot gen van dot next int well oops int world gen dot world surface uh yeah world surface low and then main dot max tiles y minus 200 uh, then we've got we close that bracket there so it work like this and a double world gen dot gen rand dot next 100 to 200 world gen dot gen rand dot next 50 to 150 then mod dot tile type tutorial biome tile true 0f 0f false true and that will generate the ore that we need so next you want to do public override and then you will be doing tile counts then you'll be typing in biome tile oops biome tiles equals tile counts mod dot tile type and you'll enter the tile name which is um Tutorial, oops, tutorial biome tile. Close off, and then you'll also be doing public override reset nearby tile effects, and you'd be doing biome tiles equals zero. Okay, now going to tutorial player. And up here, do a public static bool and we'll call it uh, zone biome equals false public override and then you'll be doing a few different commands here first one is update biomes and you do zone biome equals t 
tutorial world dot biome tiles is greater than the minimum amount before it is classed as a biome. So in this case, we're making it 50. I'm going to do comments here. Uh, change 50 to the minimum number of tiles that need to be counted before it is classed as a biome. Public override custom biomes match. Then you want to do tutorial player other player equals other dot get mod player and then you would be doing a tutorial player then mod. Then you'll be typing in uh is it return zone biome equals other player dot zone dot zone why is that not working? Oh hang on equals equals other player dot zone biome which for some reason isn't working why is it not working because I've made it static by accident don't make it a static ball otherwise it won't work okay then public override copy custom biomes to then do the same as above tutorial player other player equals equals other dot get mod player tutorial player mod then this time you're gonna do uh, you do other player dot zone biome equals zone biome okay so let me just uh put some comments in get other players using the tutorial player class this will set the zone biome uh return zone biome equal equal to that uh this will return true or false depending on other player this will set other players biome to same as this player okay so public override send custom biomes bits bytes flags equals new bits bytes then flags zero equals zone of biome then writer dot white flags public override no uh what is it receive that's the one receive custom that's bits bytes flags equals reader dot read byte nope byte and zone biome equals flags zero we leave that as it is because we'll come to that at a later point and we'll also change this at some point just make it so it returns null and that should do everything so now if we boot up actually let's just change our npc so and spawn is equal to tutorial world dot biome greater than 
50, in which case 100F, 0F. Okay, so that will make sure the tutorial zombie will only spawn in that biome. Let's load up and see. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, so now we're in, we want to create a new world. Uh, this be tutorial world B2. Tutorial, and I also have world gen uh, preview up, so you might be able to see one of the biomes spawn after the granite. There they are, including one in the sky. Do you think it's not actually meant to do? But we could see where the uh, things are meant to spawn. So I might take away the add tile part, but that's fine. Still don't know why this has spawned like it has. Because it's really screwed up the terrain now. You'll have to check over the code and see why it's doing that. Okay, let's go into the world. And let's first of all reveal the map. And guess what? We're going to use the one over here because it's very conveniently placed. As you can see, the tile has already been done. It's a bit wild and um, it works. Let's jump up here again. Oops. Let's enable spawn in. And let's increase the number to 10 so at least we'll hopefully get something. However, I think it might be an issue with the AI style. So let me just set this to night so it would work. Let me toggle god mode. Set it to night. I will get scared to death by it, but yeah, as you can see, they're spawning here, but they will not spawn anywhere else. It might spawn down here, yep, because we are below it and it's classed as a bio. Let me set this back to noon and we will just move over here and I will show you that you can create this biome. Uh currently got my custom biome stuff in the mod. Mod tutorial mod uh it is that one that's loud. Shouldn't be that loud. Let's do it up here.
Okay, that's definitely going to be enough. Let's set it to night. And let's just go out of range of it. And as you can s not see, some have spawned down here. Because these are here. So that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, I will not be updating the uh, NPC because we're going to create a custom NPC for that. We have custom AI and everything. Uh, but until next time, thank you everyone for watching. Until then, goodbye. Mm -hmm.